You make good content. Thanks, man. <laughs> Handsome self. To the London. Ow! He almost knocked my phone out my hand. Sorry, sorry. To the London. London. Going to London. Wait, are they closing the doors? Go! Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Welcome back to another weekly vlog. Today is Sunday. I usually start my vlogs on Mondays or Tuesdays, but we're starting on Sunday because we're going to Friday's concert. And I'm so excited. You're going through here. Why? Why? Huh? What's seat? Coach seat. Oh. Yeah, so we're heading to London right now. We're taking the train because it was only a two and a half hour train journey versus a four hour, four and a half, four and a half four. hour <laughs> drive. Yeah, hell no. Yeah, so we're taking the train, but we're going there tonight. It should be fun. I'm excited. You excited, babe? Yeah. Guys, our train got stopped because of an emergency. We don't know. We heard something about someone jumping on the train, but then Adam heard something about attack i'm not sure but our train is delayed so we might have to hop on a different train everybody's like getting it's off of the train we made it to london i want to find a red bus but i don't know there's one across the street but it's too small for y'all to see it's not like a double decker but um yeah it was a long ride wasn't it I have to vlog on my phone because I left my camera at home so we're not able to take it into the venue. At least, it didn't say if you could or couldn't and I didn't want to risk it, so we're vlogging on my phone today. Yeah, it looks funny. Are you excited? excited. So windy. Where are we going right now? Uh, Portobello Market. Yeah, Portobello Market. I'm about to go get a welded bracelet, so keep watching. Oh, I'm waiting on our, our Uber right now. No? Oh my goodness. You make good content. Thanks, man. <laughs> Handsome self. Okay. Haven't been in London in a minute. When's the last time you were in London? Um, last time I was in London was in 2018. Wait, 2018? no, sorry. 2021. 2021. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wild. Okay guys, this is the place I'm getting a welded bracelet at. So Me and Adam started dating, but y'all, it's loud here. So I'm gonna vlog once we're in the cab on our way to the next spot. We're 
we're at Burger and Lobster. I'm so excited this. I've wanted this for such a long time. I know exactly what I'm getting. Lobster roll, boom, done. Oops, got me about to drop this. I get a lobster roll, yes, so good. So pretty in here as well. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, I took the chives off mine, so it looks basic. <laughs> that looks delicious.
and God turned it around for me real fast. Some of y'all might see me here for like, know me for like a year, five months, but I've been going through some shit. I've been, I've been making music my whole like 10, 12 years. Working hard every day. And I just want to thank God in front of y'all tonight, you know what I'm saying? It's about me, it's about all of us. You know what I'm saying? It ain't about me, it's about all of us. I make music for all of us. When I'm in that studio, I'm going through my shit. I'm like, I gotta make some shit everybody can relate to, you know what I'm saying? Cause it ain't about the music, it's more, you know what I'm saying? And I don't know what y'all came here tonight, but I know we better have a good time. Anybody in here feel God sent? I mean, what we used to be. Yeah. 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 Let's get it. I'm not where I want to be, but I think I'm not where I used to be. I was fucked up, feeling like the devil had a hold on me. Mama cried when I bring you. You don't know the shit we been through. Was it nothing that I could do? Was it real?
don't yell at me it's wednesday i didn't vlog yesterday y'all it was a game day my man don't play i don't feel that was pretty much the day like we just literally had to go to the game at night in the daytime we literally just lounged around because crew was off from school and then adam was off technically because he had to go to the game like that was what he had to do for it which wasn't until nighttime so we we're all kind of like had the day off and so we all just lounged around and just like watched movies for the day it was nothing to vlog for so today's wednesday we're vlogging because it is i think it's gonna end up being couples night it was supposed to be like um a group night again today like we're doing we're making candles tonight y'all it's candle night candle making night we're making candles and we're also making pizza that is the plan for tonight so sydney and jt they're coming over for the candles and i think one of our other friends is coming um that's another one of adam's teammates he came last time to our game night um and we also had another friend that came to our game night. there's two other guys that came to our game night last that was not last week it was two weeks ago but one of them has like uh transferred teams he was one of my favorites on the team he transferred teams so we will probably won't see him for a long time because he now lives like closer to london um and then the other teammate and friend i think he might be coming i know adam texted him to find out if he was i know he said he wanted to do the candle making with all of us but he does live far away like his drive's like an hour and a half so I'm not sure if he's definite on coming. If he doesn't, it's just gonna end up being like a couple's night. But Sydney leaves on Friday. So we're just having one more like group night together to do some candle making, just bond, have fun, have a good time. You know, when there's three Americans in the house, it's always a good night. So we're gonna do that. Right now I'm driving to Salvation Army to try and see if I can find some like vintage bowls or cups or i don't know jars to do our candles out of because i do have some like old candles that are i cleaned them out and everything to reuse them for candles tonight as well but i also want to see if i can find any cool ones at the thrift store i'm also going to see if i can find a pot at the thrift store because i don't want to ruin my pot at home making these candles so if i can find one at this thrift store that would be that'd be great but that's what i'm doing right now the boys are at home they were gonna come but then crew i was like ah oh, you know what i don't really want him out at the store right now just he's gonna be asking for this this and that and like not letting me stay focused on what we need to do because they are coming over in about an hour and a half so i need to hurry so that's what i'm doing i'm gonna show y'all what like i see at the thrift store when we get there i'll take y'all thrifting with me and yeah hopefully tonight's a fun night i mean i know it will be but can't wait <laughs> I'm back home and I want to show you what I found at Salvation Army. So I got this jar. It's like a brown, kind of looks like a candle jar, but like purposely, I don't know. But I got this one. I got this pink jar, which kind of, or not jar, pink, like, I don't know, bowl. It kind of looks like our key bowl. Like this is our key bowl. Kind of looks the same. And I thought this would be cute for my office because most of my decorations in my office are pink. And I don't know if I'll like this one. I think it'll just be like a decoration candle. And then I found this gold one, which I thought was so pretty to sit on my bedside table. And again, I think this one might be a decoration one. I don't know if I'll be able to light it. We'll see. But I just thought it was so cute. Obviously, I think it's like a jewelry trinket bowl. But I think this will make a cute candle. And then, y'all, I found a game for us to play tonight. It's called Know Your Partner. So if it ends up being a partner's night up what is it called a date night <laughs> double date night this is a game i think would be fun to play it just has like a bunch of questions you have to see what your partner would answer sorry cruise a little loud i also found this gift for sydney and jt they love wine and it was brand new okay i opened it as you can see it's still wrapped packaged everything um all the pieces are in here i'm not gonna open it because it's not for me but i thought this would be a cute gift for them to have now i don't know how to put it back in there uh oh i don't know what's in here what's in here i like the charger and stuff yeah so cute hopefully they like it and then i also found a brand new fondue set 
the box is like falling apart but once again everything is like wrapped inside as you can see so i thought this would be so fun it's like an old-fashioned fondue set you have to like light it with a fire and we actually have the stuff you need to light it because we use it for our fire pit so i was like this will be such a cute like addition to my hosting decor so we're gonna try it out we'll see how that turns out adam is currently finishing building our tv no. console no, man. i like this color i'm glad i picked this color so you're gonna make that fall say hi guys <laughs> jt and finney are here no i don't need those we're getting the stuff for candles and a little bit of extra stuff for me <laughs> <laughs> what, vanilla and amberwood. Yeah. We're picking our scents right now for our candles tonight. Stuff for me too. No. Why? Because this isn't a shopping trip for crew. Because I, I need a new cheap, a new app after my app is broken. No, you don't. But I got crack and I have a whole. What do you think about this one? Does that smell good? Yeah. <laughs> Get that one. No, I don't like that one. <laughs> Because he wants to play hide and seek. <laughs> okay, the sleep ones and this one, because they're green. And then the happy ends, these ones, and then This shit was all I knew. You and me only. I did it all for you. Still, you were lonely. We could have worked it out. But I guess things change. It's funny how someone else's success brings pain. It's the next day. It's Thursday. JT and Sydney are over again. 
because we didn't get to do the candles. I didn't talk last night to tell you all, but we ran out of time to do the candles. So we're doing them now, the next day after they uh, the boys had training. But Sydney came over this morning and what did we do? We went to go watch the boys train for a little bit because she's never seen it. And then we went on a coffee date to Costa and well, hot chocolate and you had a latte, try a latte. And then we came home and I was working and Sydney was chilling on TikTok, huh? Napping. Napping. And Cruz napping as well. And yeah, now we're doing the candles. We've done how many so far successfully? We've got three. Three, three, three with wax in them. And we've got another three two. three or four ready to go. Okay, yeah, we're about to do a few more. Which ones we just are you did. doing next? Vanilla, Which one are you trying to do next? Or sleep? I'm fine with either. Whichever one you want to do next. Vanilla? Sure. I forget where the vanilla will be in these ones. So we've got our scents, you guys. We got them yesterday. Y'all saw this. We got vanilla and amberwood. And then happy is the one we just did. So we got happy as well. I got restore, sandalwood, cedar, and cardamom. I don't know what that means, but it smells good. I also got this number three candle that smells like men's cologne. It smells so good. And then we both got sleep. I just don't know where mine is, but we also got sleep. And I think I'm gonna put this one next to my bed. So I need to pick a really good, like aesthetically pleasing candle for this one. I think this is the one I'm gonna do for next to my bed. I think this would be cute for that because it has a cover somewhere. I don't know, oh, here it is. It has a cover to close it. I think that would be cute next to my bed. The boys are over here putting in wicks. Romy, how's it going guys? It's intense. Uh, right. <laughs> it's intense. I'm so locked in. <laughs> we really don't know what we're doing, you guys. We're kind of just Maybe going with the flow and seeing how it turns out. Not really. Oh, babe, that was supposed to have a wood wick in that one. Oh, man. Yeah. It's okay. Oh, because I didn't know you had the wood wick. I'm getting involved. That person has it all. And you just stuck standing there. But I'm going to need you to say something, baby. Say something, baby. Say something, baby. Say something. I'm going to need you to say something, baby. I'm going to need you to say something, baby. I am the topic of conversation. It's a celebration. It's toast to the fact that I moved out my mama basement to a condo downtown. Because it's all about location. I'm sitting straight wide and watch California. Fornication of life. You should have been here to kick it with me. We could have split this whole thing up 50 50. But now I'm at the 40 40 getting bitches tipsy. Killing shit to ever so talented, Mr. Ripley. How I go from being a man that you argue with to me and Dwayne Carter putting out the hardest shit. I should want to go back to the one I started with. But I'm addicted to this life. It's going to be hard to quit. Yeah. Just ask me how things are coming along. You can tell me that you never heard none of my songs. As long as you you end up saying one day you plan to listen Cause what's the start when it's most this important fan is missing all I knew You and me, I'm only I did it all for you Still you were lonely If we could have worked it out But I guess things change Funny how someone else's success brings pain When you're no longer involved That person has it all And you just stuck standing there But I'm gonna need you to say something, baby Say something, baby Say something, baby Say something I'm gonna need you to say something, baby These are all of our candles that we made They look so cute um, JT and Sydney left already But I just want to show you guys how they turned out We just have to wait for them to cure and then we can enjoy but they guys my house smells like a candle this was honestly such a fun activity to do i've been wanting to do it for quite some time and i was gonna do it like on my own but when sydney was here i was like actually this would be fun to do together and plus jt really likes candles as well so i thought it'd be a fun little group thing and it was excuse me and it was um but yeah, my house smells like a candle now, which is a win-win to me, if you ask. However, it was a mess, like, especially because we didn't really know what we were doing. So we did mess up a little bit here and there, but overall it was fun. I definitely do it again. And uh, yeah, now I'm about to eat a little bit of lunch. It's only four o'clock, so I'm gonna eat a little bit of lunch. We're all going out to dinner later tonight. So they went home to like change, rest up, and get ready for that. But you will be seeing them again because like I said, yeah, we're going to dinner and tonight is Sydney's last night before she has to catch her flight tomorrow. Done. I gotta tell you guys what I'm doing, but one second. 
I look a mess. I've been editing for y'all the last hour or so, but it's a sad moment, y'all. We're not going out to dinner anymore because Sydney still had to pack, and I know she went to spend her last day with JT. So um, they were gonna come back, and my hair looks really wild with this crazy bun. They were gonna come back and get their candles and go to dinner, but instead I'm shipping it to them via Uber. Yeah, the Uber's here right now. She's texting me that it's here. I'm so sad. By the way, our candles, mm -mm, we ain't candle makers. They like, I'll show you when I get back. Hold on one second. Let me just send this off. Thank you. All right, the candles are in route. And let me text her. She has the location, so I'm sure she's seen it. Okay, let me show y'all what happened to the candles. <laughs> they got booty holes, y'all. I don't know. I think we just didn't. We need to like make sure the temperature's right or something. Because, yeah, they got booty holes. Every single one of them. Like, look at them. They're dipping. <laughs> They're all doing that. It's so weird. Do y'all see it? So, we definitely obviously did something wrong. This one's okay for right now. Actually, no. I can see that it's starting to dip right here. I think this is the only one that, like didn't mess up as you can see but to be fair i used the same candle wicks for these two and i didn't oh actually sorry same candle wicks for these two so i'm guessing that's why these two aren't messed up must have been right temperature by luck i don't know but it's cute i ordered um a wick cutter to come tomorrow so we can cut these down and close them and then I'm going to let them cure for like a week before I actually start lighting them. Because they might be a little dangerous right now. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, that's our Thursday night. I'm going to bed, y'all. I need to go shower and go to sleep because I'm going to the gym in the morning. And I have a doctor's appointment as well. So I had blood drawn. Basically, I basically had an appointment last week or earlier this week. I can't remember. No, it was last week. It was last week. And we're not going to get sensitive here, y'all. I don't need no comments about it or nothing. But, like, they, my test results came back. And they're a little worried about, I'm not even going to say it out loud. Because we don't need that type of energy out there in the air. But I need to go back tomorrow to have them draw blood now to see, like, what's really good. You know what I mean? So, wish me luck. Um, I'm going to go to bed. And I will see y'all tomorrow. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It is Saturday. Actually, it's not, even, it's not morning, it's afternoon, but I'm just not picking up the camera because this morning we just had breakfast as a family. It is it is game day, but Adam's not playing, so he gets to stay home. Since he stayed home, we decided to have a lovely breakfast together. It was so good. We had waffles, eggs, sausage. It was delicious, and it's actually such a nice day today. Like, it's not raining it's a little cold still i mean we're in the uk but it's not raining it's not snowing it's not any of that it's not windy so the sun is out which is why it's glaring on my face right now wait let me see there's the sun wait there's the sun and so yeah we've been we had breakfast we've been lounging i just got out the shower though i washed my hair because i'm about to straighten it again with the yeah but, but <laughs> he was about to walk in here with his shorts hiked up but um what was i saying yeah i'm gonna straighten my hair since when i went to the friday concert it literally ruined my hair it literally turned my hair back to this so i'm gonna re-straighten my hair and then we're gonna build some more ikea stuff that i bought <laughs> last time we went we got the same dresser this dresser for crew's room so we're gonna build that and put that in cruise room. We also got one for um, our kitchen. It's not a dresser, it's like a, what would you call that, babe? Uh, cabinet. A cabinet, yeah, I guess like a cabinet for the kitchen. You'll see, I'll show y'all once we build it. And then also, look y'all, look how pretty my side table looks. This is what my side table looks like. I just organized it today, isn't it so? pretty i usually have my phone here charging as well but we've got my ipad which i think is dead let's see oh no it's not it's actually fully charged so cute 
that's my screen saver if you wanted to see it and then we've got the candle that i made the other day with jt sydney and adam i haven't lit it yet but isn't that so pretty y'all and this is like the crackling wood wick so it makes sound and then look i just cover it like that that's so pretty to me oh my gosh and then i have my jewelry here i forgot to take the tag off of this uh tray but in case you're interested it's from bnm five pounds and then it has my lighter for my candles and then this is a wick cutter and then i've got my laptop and my phone there and that is my nightstand let me show you all adam's because i organized his as well today so this is adam's side table he has his water dispenser i don't know why he doesn't have a cup here yet but usually there's a cup a glass sitting here for his water dispenser he's got his candle he made this one it's a brown one i think it's more manly it looks really nice on his table double wicked up so cute and then he's got a water bottle here and his laptop and his ipad and then his tray as well with two remotes and his watch and that's his so that's what our room is looking like so far i love it it looks so sophisticated it's definitely giving off like hotel vibes especially this candle i'm so excited to light this actually i think i'm gonna light it right now because i was just waiting to film it but since you guys are watching now i guess i can film it that looks gorgeous oh my goodness oh this is gonna be so cute at night wow adam is putting together crew's dresser like i told y'all earlier his pieces here he's a workstation how's it going babe Inside. yeah you know what you're doing this time around right because mm -hmm. you did the other two yeah. so i'm talking about mm, this is sexy <laughs> Ugh. Look at the leg muscles the arm muscles let me see flex real quick <laughs> let me see those arms real quick babe show no, man show them who's putting the, putting this together Show him it with the earrings. Oh! <laughs> Did you guys notice he dyed his hair as well? We dyed it again. Not we. Like, he dyed it again. I mean we because it was my idea to do it in the first place. But you guys remember I dyed his hair black a while back ago. A while back ago? What? Is that? A while back. <laughs> and then it turned back to brown because his hair grows really fast. So he went to the barber and the barber dyed it black again. And yeah, just looks real clean. Look at me. Give them a little look. Okay. Give a little uh, so every day you want to feel yourself in the mirror now the camera's on you you want to act shy i'm shy i am shy. Sure. you're not shy you're just a liar <laughs> that's what you are sure. the lies you're not shy look at those leg muscles you guys dating a footballer look at the Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> you said what i got my cut from my hair get this hot a black hat of water again. Good news if I get a haircut, I could get a bit polite. <laughs> but I couldn't get a haircut today. You only want to get a haircut because you want to get a surprise. Yeah, because you said that. Because I know you and Adam said that. But are you going to sit still the whole time? Yeah. If we, go, if we get ready to go. We're not going right now. Why? Mommy's building something. Why, why do you like to see... I don't know how football, though. No, he's downstairs making Mommy tea because my throat's hurting. Tea? Mm-hmm. But I'm building this. Me and Adam, we're building this. Mommy's just hammering some nails into it. But this is for your room. What you do for my room? Because you needed something bigger to keep in all your um, books and stuff because they were falling out. So it looks just like mommy's. That's what it's going to look like. Then we both have the same. Yep. Yeah. Do you like that? Match it. Mm -hmm. Do I look like I'm dying? Because I probably am. I've literally been so sick. This morning I woke up. And my throat was hurting, which is why Adam made me tea. I don't know if I showed you guys that he made me tea earlier, but he made me tea because my throat was hurting. And then now my head is hurting, like the lights. I'm about to turn them off. I just turned them on to talk to y'all, but the lights are hurting. I have a really bad, like, migraine. And I think it's because 
<laughs> Obviously, y'all know I'm at home for the most part every day. Like I work from home. Uh, you know, obviously we go out to like the grocery store, like the movies once in a while or whatever, shopping, you know, but like I'm not really around people for the most part of my day except for crew and Adam. And now that crew's back in school, I've been like picking him up from school and being around all these nasty kids <laughs> that probably have so many like sicknesses, illnesses and don't even know it and germs and bacteria. And so I think that by me, like usually when I pick up crew, I'm there for about like five to 10 minutes just talking to the teacher and some of the kids will say hi to us or talk to crew or whatever. But also, also my camera died <laughs> and I'm too, like, I don't feel good enough to go up and change the battery and do all that. But anyways, I'm just trying to say like, I think with crew being in school, it's making me more like inviting to other people's illnesses and sicknesses that he's picking up from school and his immune system is like good because he's around the kids all day but mine not so much that's the only way I think I could have gotten sick because I haven't really been doing anything crazy these last few days so um yeah I just feel disgusting and I feel tired my head hurts everything hurts and I'm really hot so with that being said I didn't get a time to like do my hair I even like told myself I was gonna take a nap earlier today and I did I woke up feeling even worse so hair is not done I have church in the morning hopefully I feel better by then um but the dresser did get built where is it that's not it where is it oh it's there we just need to put the door the doorknobs <laughs> the knobs on it and then take it to crew's room but we did finish that we didn't get to the like kitchen one that we need to build but that will have to be for next week's vlog because it's not getting done tonight we're literally we just ordered dinner we're having pizza tonight because adam also has a headache <laughs> so pizza is the easiest thing to have tonight we're gonna have pizza and crew's gonna take a bath and go to bed and i'm calling it a night from here on i'm just gonna watch some love on the spectrum until i can probably fall asleep or something but that's tonight that's the weekend i wish we would have ended on a better note but it's all right i'll be better tomorrow thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed it was such a fun week for me from the friday concert to hanging out with sydney and jt and doing like candles and game night etc it was such a fun night so i mean it's such a fun week so more content soon